Now back to the Fitz Show. He's funny. I think he's a cool guy. Fitz happens. Live, live, live. Everybody, welcome back to the show. Uh, my name is Fitz. There's Drew. Tanner, the millennial, is right there. There's Jenna, my head of security. I think it was a couple of days ago we had another edition of a Drew Spiracy. And that's where my buddy Drew kind of gives uh, um, his thoughts on kind of conspiracy theories he's developed in his head. And and, and I, I, I wanted to provide him you know, this platform to tell the world about some of these conspiracy theories you say they're what well they're truths they aren't okay. theories they're truths right. uh, and you make me sound like a crazy person when you say i made up in my head but there's a lot of people that that subscribe to these exact same ideas um do you remember the one you did last week uh do you remember yeah, i was talking about the facial recognition software that we right. all voluntarily just gave up our data to right uh do you mind if i share a little letter about that oh yeah, I just received a little complaint message about about you, and I was wondering if I could share it with you. Okay, about some people, you know, making comments about your Drew spiracies. All right, it says, uh, "Dear Fitz, Jenna Tanner, the Millennial, and especially Drew. For the past couple of months, we've been listening to those Drew spiracies. This is where we hear about Drew's problem against the quote global uh, the uh, quote global multi corporate confederation or whatever that stupid crap he says." <laughs> Can we please stop this? Apparently, Drew is on a mission to freak everyone out. No, tattoos don't track us, Drew. No, toilet wipes are not a way to infect us with medicine from the government. And no, the white background on Facebook isn't watching us and recording us 24-7. Go back into your bunker with your robe and wine and stop trying to scare everyone. I've looked into your research, and I haven't found one of your st silly statistics anywhere on the internet. I think you're freaking yourself out because you like to freak yourself out. Thus, you're freaking everyone else out with fake facts. Fake news, Drew. Fake news, Drew. That's what we should all start calling you. It's not healthy. Please find a new and productive hobby instead of developing these stupid Drew Spiracies. <laughs> wow. Dang. So, can all I right, respond? And, and, and by the way, wherever you are right now, at home, at work, in the car, listening on the app, we'd love to hear from you as well. So this is what we like to call a classic government disinformation campaign. <laughs> <laughs> what they do is they will pose as a person or an organization, and they'll oh. make these kind of attacks that are always aimed at just making you sound silly and ridiculous. But why? if this stuff is going on, why wouldn't they want you to think this? Exactly what they want you to this think. This is one of our person, They always make you sound crazy. This is actually uh, one of our huge uh, listeners um, listens to the show all the time. I don't think that this is someone the government, you know, Paid to have this individual message how do, how us do you on know Facebook. It's that person? Drew, where do you get your research from? There yeah, are a lot you... of sources, and here's the thing: someone, YouTube. This person, no. <laughs> there are places on the Info internet. Wars. <laughs> there are places on the internet that most don't. Yeah, like what? Venture to? Well, you can't get. You have to have a special browser to get there, and I don't want to say a lot more than that. What do you uh, mean a special browser? It's the dark web. I mean, there are, and and uh, that's. People talk about it. Most people have heard of it, but don't know what All it right. is or where it is, and that's how you get there. You have it's a special browser, and it's almost right. like an invitation thing. Like you have I, to I'm just letting you know that there vetted. are some some, <laughs> some listeners who listen to these Drew Spiracies, and they're on to you, and they're they're trying to track this information that you talk about. I don't think this is the actual listener. I don't even think it's the person whoever's name they put on that yeah. because it's extremely Erica. Easy. Erica, are, are you aware of the NSA? They can intercept. Okay. You, they can intercept any of your accounts and, and write as if they're you. All right, so there you go. Welcome to the Fit Show. Fits happens live. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome. You're listening to the Fit Show. Fits happens live.